In the mid-20th century, newspapers and broadcasters flooded the public with warnings that oil depletion was imminent. As industrialization accelerated, oil became a massive pillar supporting modern civilization. The fear spread that if this crucial resource disappeared, the civilization humanity had built would gradually collapse. After all, it seemed only natural that continuously extracting a finite underground resource would eventually lead to its exhaustion. Yet decades passed, centuries turned, and the oil that was supposed to run out soon continues to flow. Of course, technological advancements played a significant role. New exploration technologies kept uncovering unknown oil reserves, and advanced drilling techniques made it possible to extract oil even from previously inaccessible geological layers. But even so, the sheer abundance of oil remains strangely inexplicable. The predicted point of depletion kept getting pushed further and further back, to the point where some extreme predictions now suggest that humanity might go extinct before oil ever runs out. At this point, a fundamental question emerges. What exactly is oil, and why does it seem to keep replenishing itself? To unravel this mystery, scientists began by analyzing the composition of oil. Oil is essentially a mixture of hydrocarbons. For hydrocarbons to form, they require an environment with little to no oxygen. So where on Earth could carbon accumulate abundantly while remaining isolated from the oxygen-rich atmosphere? That place is the ocean floor. The ocean is home to countless plankton and algae. When these tiny organisms die, they sink to the ocean floor, forming layer upon layer of sediment. Over millions of years, heat and pressure transform these sediments into hydrocarbons, oil. This is the widely accepted scientific theory known as the biogenic theory. However, this theory alone struggles to explain everything. No matter how much organic matter accumulated over time, it seems insufficient to account for the vast amounts of oil we have discovered. Moreover, some reports even claim that depleted oil fields appear to have been naturally replenished over time. Some scientists propose that oil originates from non-living sources rather than biological material, a hypothesis known as the abiogenic theory. One such extreme environment untouched by Earth's atmosphere is deep within the planet's crust. Abiogenic theory suggests that hydrocarbons could form through chemical reactions between carbon and hydrogen in the high-pressure, high-temperature conditions of Earth's mantle. Some laboratory experiments have even successfully simulated mantle conditions, confirming that hydrocarbons can form. If this hypothesis is correct, it could reasonably explain why oil reserves are far more abundant than expected, and why some depleted reservoirs appear to have been naturally replenished. That would mean oil is still being formed deep within the Earth, and slowly making its way to the surface even now. Yet despite these intriguing ideas, the abiogenic theory has never gained mainstream acceptance. The overwhelming body of scientific evidence still strongly supports the idea that oil comes from ancient life forms. Notably, oil contains a chemical compound called porphyrin, which is found in chlorophyll from plants and hemoglobin in animals. This suggests that oil is not merely an inorganic substance, but rather the remnants of once living organisms. The more we learn, the deeper the mystery grows. For now, the biogenic theory remains the most convincing explanation for oil formation. But as mentioned earlier, some unanswered questions still remain. Some researchers have proposed that a massive, undiscovered microbial ecosystem may exist deep within the Earth's geological layers, one that could play a role in oil formation. Well, all of this remains purely hypothetical for now. But one thing is certain, we still don't fully understand the true origins of oil, even as science advances and humanity ventures into space. At moments like this, one realization becomes undeniable. The Earth is also part of the universe. Even though we stand on solid ground, this planet remains full of mysteries. If there's any consolation, the key to solving this mystery lies right beneath our feet.